Hi everyone. Today I want to share my thoughts on aliens. What we Christians, true believers in Jesus Christ, know as demons and fallen angels. For me, deception is when people choose to believe falsehood rather than the truth. One day, Satan convinced his slave, Charles Darwin, the man who propounded the theory of evolution. Satan convinced him that humans were the outcome of a big bang. Others in the same camp with him have run with that idiotic story over the centuries and torn many people's hearts away from God. The same people who propagated the falsehood of Big Bang Theory are now telling us that aliens are visiting the Earth. In fact, one of them, so-called scientists, claimed to have discovered that aliens crafted man's DNA, in quote, Aliens crafted man's DNA. Wow. Satan is such a moron, and those who side with him are just like him. Why is it easier for the so-called scientists to believe in aliens than to believe in God? Are aliens also products of Big Bang? For me, scientists who believe in such falsehood who deny God are a bunch of morons, just like the devil. Unfortunately, many people have swallowed their lies. And Satan is smiling to the bank. I'm sure he believes that the lake of fire that is his final, is it a resting place or punishing place? I don't know which one, which one to use. He believes that the lake of fire will be cooler if he can entrap billions of humans to end up there with him. He knows that most of them walk by sight. That is why he's causing fallen angels and demons to manifest as aliens, so as to deceive those marked for destruction. No wonder the scripture says that God will give those who reject the truth a strong delusion to believe a lie so that believe, to be, believe a lie so that they will be damned. That is in Second Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 11. The good news is that the door of God's mercy is still open. But the bad news is that it won't be open forever. Accept the truth now, today, while you still have the opportunity to do so. Tomorrow might be too late for you. 2 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 2 says, Behold, now is the acceptable time. Behold, now is the day of salvation. Take advantage of God's mercy now. Otherwise, you end up spending eternity in the lake of fire with Satan. A word is enough for the wise.